I want to talk to you guys about custom making a custom sanding block using a standard 3 inch by 21 inch belt sander belt. A sanding block is typically used to provide solid backing or flat support when using sandpaper, right? We, you know, we all know that. And in a pinch, I typically grab a scrap block of wood and some sandpaper and I just do that for small operations. But when I know I'm going to be doing a lot of sanding or I need some really durable stuff, hand sanding. I use my custom made blocks that are designed to be used with 3 inch by 20 inch sanding belts. I made these blocks to cover several different common grits, so I just reach for the right grit that I want. You know, if you wanted to buy something like this, fancier sanding belts, they use clips and teeth and clamps to hold sandpaper in place. And these brands typically only hold a quarter or a half sheet of sandpaper that's thinner than belt sanding paper anyway. The, the sanding block uses a full 3 by 21 inch belt. And instead of using the 9x11 sandpaper, there is no cutting, there's no adjusting to mount the sandpaper. And I can just flip it around or use it around and um, rotate it around for fresh grit. And the best advantage of using this sanding belt is its longevity. It lasts at least 10 times longer than regular sandpaper. It doesn't rip or tear on sharp edges. And you can clean it using one of those eraser type cleaners and it can be reused. So here's how you make it. You basically just measure your belt, your width, three inches by the inside diameter of the belt, and then cut a block of wood three inches wide to that length, and uh, basically using a miter saw, you wanna clip both sides of the corners, all four corners of that board. You wanna sand those 45 degree clips around so it's nice smooth radius. You could use a router, I suppose, but this is quicker. And then you wanna just test fit your sanding belt and then just sand away. You're ready to go. So guys, I wanna know, do you have any sanding tips? What do you guys use on your job sites? Please comment on this video and share your tips. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button right there below, and I'll see you guys at the next video. Take care.